morning traders this is Taylor from the trading analyst.com where you can enjoy all of the member only features for free like the live chat room educational videos and the real-time option and stock alerts with your very own 10-day free trial where you're not only going to be making money from the alerts that we're giving you but you also have the opportunity to learn while you earn in the classroom setting of the live chat room we truly do care about your success and we focus on trader education at thetradinganalyst.com. It's a great opportunity, and I really suggest that you take advantage of it. So we're going to take a look at the S&P 500 chart here really quick. Uh, we've got uh, a downtrend line here that uh, the S&P 500 is working against. Uh, we've also got some uh, big supply in the area around 204 uh, from the previous lows. I'll expand the chart so you can see it. So here it is where you can see it a little expanded. We've got it, uh, the lows over here, and it was also the uh, breakdown point uh, where we really saw some massive downside um, from the, you know, quote unquote crash. Um, we can also uh, point to some uh, touches around here in that area, around here, 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 here. So this area that we're at around this range uh, is a big range. Uh, we've also got another level of a pretty big resistance at 206. Um, that if we do break over the 204, it's going to be a lot of resistance at 206. Uh, you know, there's a lot of people that uh, are stuck holding the bag and they want to sell at break even. They're going to be waiting, waiting for us up here. So uh, just be careful long up there if it does break over 204. Um, and I'll zoom in a little bit so you can see it a little better. So just be aware uh, of those resistance points. Uh, I'm not saying we can't go higher. I'm just saying that it's going to be extremely difficult to do so. Uh, moving forward with today's action and where I think we are headed uh, in the near term, uh, today's action saw a gap up to a fade, and that is typically bearish action. Um, when you have a gap up and then a fade down, that's bearish especially when it engulfs the previous three days, okay? We engulfed the previous three days. We also closed below this level of support right here from the lows of these candles, the highs of this candle, and the highs of these candles over here. Uh, we have a gap to fill down here from this candle, and that is at close of this candle is 199.29 and I believe we will fill that within the next uh, few days uh, it'll probably take uh, next week to fill uh, we'll see uh, but there is some, some pretty nice support um, in that 199 range so we should get um, at least just a small uh, at least a mini bounce from this 199 area and then we're going to see how it reacts if we break the 199, then we've got this gap to fill down here at 195, okay, after that gap. Um, but so right now, I'm just willing to uh, say that we are going to fill this gap down here after this bearish engulfing candle. We were breaking, we were in this range for one, two, three days, okay, and then we finally broke below it. Okay, so when it gets in this tight range and then we finally see a direction out of it, it should be at least a, a pretty decent sized move. Okay, so if it broke to the upside, that we would get long. But since it broke to the downside and closed below these lows, um, we are short on the S&P 500 and we're going for this gap fill. Okay. Um, and another thing I want to point out is we did have a little bit of an uptick in volume. As you can see here relative to the last few days, it is on the higher end. Um, nothing too too high, but uh, um, definitely higher than the last couple days. Um, and that's the other thing you want to look for when, when you're in a tight range is you want to see it uh, not only a, a strong candle like this, uh, but you also want to see a, a pop in volume as well. Um, in either direction okay so and that's what we got this is a pretty good signal um, and I do like the S&P 500 short um, to fill this gap down here 
Uh, that's it for the analysis. Hopefully you enjoyed and learned a thing or two about technical analysis. Again, you can sign up for the, the tradinganalyst.com for free. You'll be making money from the alerts that we're giving you. You'll also join us in the chat room, learning lots and lots about technical analysis. You can learn easy to use, simple strategies that will help you become a more profitable, successful, and consistent trader. It's a great opportunity, and I really suggest that you take advantage of it. We'll see you over there.